Hi guys, just showed you the video where I bought this in the charity shop along with two other items and I showed that it's got the battery pack missing and no transmitter but it does say 40 megahertz on it, it's a new bright got no name on it underneath other than new bright but it does tell you it's a Corvette on the side so first thing I'll do is see if I can rig up some batteries and we can check whether it works and I just happen to have eight AA NICAD batteries in a little battery container it's not the right one to go in there but I can put some crocodile clips on it and we should be able to rig it up and see whether the receiver works. Positive, negative, on off switch. And I've got one of my 40 megahertz transmitters. So it looks like we got gold here. Well, in the original video I described it as garbage because it's missing the battery pack and it's missing the transmitter. So no good to anybody who hasn't already got those parts. What I think I'll do is I'll just tape the battery pack on somewhere just so we can see if we can get it running. Under there there's a nice gap. So I'll put some tape around it to stop it falling apart and then just lay it up under there. There we are. Just some ordinary masking tape to hold the wires in place. That should sit under there. Oh, that's a shame. Forwards and reverse are reversed. That should be forward, that should be reverse. Yeah, and the steering's reversed. Not a problem. If I had the proper new bright controller, and I think I do have one tucked away somewhere, we could do that, or I could just swap the wires over. But we'll give it a little test in the kitchen. There's no way we got enough space for it to turn all the way round. So let's just try forwards, backwards and a 96 point turn. struggling a little bit with that 
transmitter. Either the batteries need replacing or it's not quite um, matching. You can see it shuddering a bit as I'm doing it. Yeah, that'll do. Looks good. And if we convert it to proper hobby grade, that'll be fine.